All right, let's go to catchers and infielders here. Gary Sanchez of the Twins. He is priced at 3600 today on DraftKings. Ty France, 4300 Tommy Edmond of the Cardinals just uh, dropping like a rock in terms of price. Cardinals have struggled offensively. 3300 Max Muncy, I believe yesterday. Did he get on base five times? Did I see that without recording an out? 4200 and then Bo Bichette, 5400 today for the Jays. Yeah, so Muncie is, I think, just an example of the pricing getting a little bit too a little bit too dynamic, right? You know, when guys, I, I believe, heading into yesterday, he had like a four for thirty stretch going, and there was some talk of like, oh, you know, maybe maybe Jake Lamb is going to be taking over for him or, or something like that. Well, it's not going to happen. I mean, Max Muncie is too good to go hitless for that long. Had a great game against the St. Louis Cardinals yesterday. Gary Sanchez. Just, uh, I mean, I, I know the guy can't hit for batting average to save his life, but this is still Gary Sanchez, 10 home runs on the year, just hit one uh, last week. And he has not, He I suppose he has not been playing full-time either. They have their full complement of catchers and, and DHs back in, so he's only playing about four days a week right now. Our guy, Ty France, he is really trying to make the uh, the All Star Game, Craig. You know he's sitting there saying, "Guys, come on, a- Andrew Benintendi is in the All Star Game, and I'm not in the All Star Game. What are we What are we doing here?" Uh, he's having he's having a great season, and I like this offensive environment for the Mariners. Same thing on Edmund as with Muncie. I mean, I just think Edmund's a good player. I think the St. Louis Cardinals have a good offense that's just kind of in. You know, the teams teams go through this, right? Uh, what did we say? We the Angels lost fourteen games in a row with maybe the two best players of baseball on their roster. Like teams just go through these slumps. It's no big deal. I think Edmund uh, will be back soon. And then I I do like this spot. I mean, I think that the Toronto Blue Jays are just going to be crushing the Kansas City Royals for the next couple of days, right? Uh, Ten of their players not eligible to play. Uh, they have guys coming up from AAA to play. You know, like they're just. I don't know. They might have they might have a, a fan come in and pitch the bottom of the ninth. Well, they're down ten. Like I think the Blue Jays might score. Uh, I think I think we might get some football scores in this series on the Blue Jays side because I think it was three of their relief pitchers are are out for this week, so they're really going to the bottom. So I, I do really like the Blue Jays. Yeah, I think you have to a pretty big advantage, I would say, in this series. 